However, after a year or two of having the card, everything seemed to have changed, which is why I canceled the card since when I weigh the benefits of keeping it. GetGo Platinum Visa is just one of the few credit cards that is offered by Union Bank of the Philippines. My card was issued to me last December 2017 and everything was all good at that time, especially that I can use it free for one year before I get to be charged an annual fee of 5,000 pesos. Back then, there were four airport lounges where the card is honored. One in Clark, two in Aia, and one in Davao. What I loved most was the lounge in Davao until they ceased operation sometime last year since it was located outside the final security check of both international and domestic airport. Which means I can take advantage of the lounge even if I am flying domestic. The other benefits that I love most was the free 5 kilogram extra baggage allowance. Aside from the priority check-in at the airport so I can cut the long queue and check in ahead of the rest. However, after a year or two of having the card, everything seemed to have changed, which is why I canceled the card since when I weigh the benefits of keeping it compared to how much annual fee I am paying on a yearly basis, it just doesn't seem to provide any advantage at all. So here are the reasons why I decided to let go of the GetGo Platinum Visa card by Union Bank of the Philippines. From four airport lounges, the card now only offers one lounge access and only specific to the Skyview Lounge at Naia 3. Unlike other banks that offers platinum cards that has the same annual fee, a lot of them offers two lounge credits every year that you can use not just on any lounges here in the Philippines, but also on the rest of the world. For being 5,000 peso annual fee with GetGo Platinum Visa, you can only get lounge access at Naia Terminal 3. This is very good if you often use Naia Terminal 3 as your exit point since you get unlimited access. Otherwise, it would be better to go with other banks of platinum credit card that can provide you to lounge access worldwide on a yearly basis. The extra 5 kilo baggage allowance isn't very useful for me anymore after they changed their minimum check-in baggage from 15 to 20 kilos. For a standard domestic carry-on luggage size of 22 by 14 by 9, the most that you can put inside that luggage, no matter what or how much stuff you pack inside, is just 15 to 20 kilos. The extra 5 kilos would have been very useful for their old 15 kilo prepaid baggage allowance. The so-called priority check-in actually made me experience airport check-in humiliation for three times. And that is because the check-in counter officer doesn't even know what the card is. And to them, it's just an ordinary get-go card. So I had to talk to supervisors just to clarify so that I won't have to cut the line next time. I also escalated the issue to their customer service channel, but just as expected, nobody replied. Platinum cards are one of the premium level credit cards that features low interest rates but with high annual fees. So it would be very best to carefully weigh the pros and cons of keeping one just to ensure you are taking advantage of the full potential of the annual fee that you are or will be paying for year after year.